Hello everyone, it is January again, and that means it's time for CES 2016. So we're going to break it down with the top random items from the first day of CES. Number one on our list is the Alltech Lansing Freedom Earbuds. These are Bluetooth earbuds. They have a companion app, and what makes them a little bit different, other than being extremely ugly, is they have Bluetooth-based GPS so you can find out where they are. They are also water resistant. They have a 100 foot Bluetooth range, a wind canceling microphone, and a six hour battery life. That battery life is also supplemented with a three hour secondary charge from the little traveling case that is included. Comes in nine different colors, comes out quarter two 2016 for $149. Number two on our list from the first day of CES 2016 is going to be the Griffin BreakSafe cable. Now, when the new MacBook came out, it did not have MagSafe, it had USB Type-C. And unfortunately, it, it didn't have any MagSafe type qualities. You literally had a cord plugged in, just like most of the PCs out there. Well, now Griffin has kind of mirrored that in the BreakSafe cable, which is a USB Type-C cable. It's actually a one long cable that's six feet long with this little magnetic connector on the end. It extends out from your Mac by about 12.8 millimeters, which is not too much, and this will be arriving in April for $39. Next up on our list for number three is the new Phantom Drones. Now they introduced a couple of these different drones at CES 2016. One basically just came in a different color, but the really cool one is the Phantom 3 4K. This is the first one other than the Professional Series that has a 4K camera. It does use Wi-Fi instead of the Lightbridge video downlink system, which means it's got a smaller range, so it does have a range of about three quarters of a mile, but considering the FCC says you have to fly it within range of your pilot anyway, that should be good for most people. It does come with a 4K camera and will come in at $999, which is quite less than the Professional model. Number four on the list. This is kind of cool one and kind of small, and that's going to be the Force Band from Sphero. Now, Sphero made a lot of waves when they released the BB-8 Sphero, um, basically just a little BB-8 with a little head on top, and it rolls around, and you can control it with your smartphone. But now with this Force Band, you can basically move your arm to control Sphero itself. This will come out in fall 2016, but unfortunately, we don't have a lot of information yet. They simply had a prototype out at CES for everyone to kind of play around with. Now let's go from toys to more business solutions, and that would be the new Samsung SSD. And this is going to be the T3. Last year they had the T1 uh, solid state drive come out, and this new version is the T3, uh, and it has a capacity of 250 gigs up to two terabytes, all solid state. It's ridiculously fast at 450 megabits per second. It weighs in under two ounces, and of course it uses USB Type-C or the USB 3.1, which is gonna work great on all those Chromebooks and Mac books that are out there. This will be arriving in February of 2016, but unfortunately we don't have a price. Last generation, it launched at $600, so let's start with something like that. If we go on the next item on the list, let's go to look at appliances. And that would be the Samsung Smart Fridge, which has been making a lot of news. It has a gigantic 1080p touchscreen tablet built right into the door. Not only that, but it has an embedded camera inside so you can actually see what's in your fridge and can alert you if something is going bad or if it's been there too long. It has stereo speakers in there so you can possibly play music through there. It has news and weather systems built in and included seasonal recipes that'll show up right on your little tablet there. And you do have some remote applications so you can see how your fridge is doing and what you have in your fridge while you're on the go or at the grocery store. Moving on to the next item on the list, number seven, and that would be Whirlpool Appliances. Their new washer and dryer are pretty neat because they actually are app enabled, which many have been in the past, but these new ones build in Amazon Dash, which means they can automatically reorder you supplies as you're going through them. So it'll know when you're low and allow you to one touch order them and just have them at your door. So you never have to worry about when you're running out of laundry detergent or bounce sheets. If you're interested, this will be coming out later this year, and they'll sell for around $13.99. If you're interested in learning more about Amazon Dash, go ahead and click on that link there, and it'll take you to our mini review that we did over the Dash buttons. And last up on our list from the first day of CES 2016 would be the Withings Thermo. Now, this is basically a really high-tech temporal thermometer. So instead of having to stick this in your mouth or in your ear, you can just do this right up on the forehead. It has 4,000 measurements in two seconds, which is done with 16 independent sensors. It's extremely accurate and extremely fast. And again, you can all do it by just placing it on the forehead. It's even color coded to let you know if the temperature level is good or bad. So it'll give you green if it's good, orange if it's moderate, or red if it's danger. 
This will be coming out in quarter one 2016 for $99. If you're interested in anything, go ahead and let me know. Throw any questions up in the comments. Other than that, please subscribe and check out our other videos on CES. Other than that, I'll see you guys next time.